The Blue Jays unveil the latest renovations to the Rogers Center today. The new look dome features five different fan sections and a wide variety of new food options. Adam Atkinson gives us a quick tour. Following the cutting of this giant ribbon, phase one of the Rogers Center renovations were unveiled. Today's the start, the start that we get to unveil the transformation of this stadium, transforming Rogers Center from a stadium to a ballpark. We're really excited. Um, we have modernized our ballpark, really bringing fans closer to the action. And we are so, so excited for fans to come and see five new distinct spaces that we have here in our ballpark. The new spaces like the Corona rooftop patio and Park Social are open to anyone who has a ticket. First come, first serve. It's meant to be a cool rooftop, uh, you know, patio experience. Uh, and it certainly has, uh, you know, a more premium feel to it. And uh, yeah, I think, you know, this is just one of many different uh, experiences that we've created here at Rogers Center. We really wanted to bring, you know, the city into the ballpark. So we really tried to bring the diversity of the food, um, some art and entertainment into every space. So each space has their unique and distinct experience. And each of the new fan sections like Park Social have their own food choices as well, like grilled cheese. and churros and pea bacon sandwich in the Corona rooftop patio. That's good. There's a lot of new food offerings right here in Park Social. This is our food truck style eats. We have uh, grilled cheese, a bacon pepper grilled cheese, churros, uh, Ace's milkshake. Uh, down in the stop, we have Jamaican patties, bomb sandwiches. There's lots of diversity, just like Toronto, that we bought into, brought into the ballpark. Phase two of the $300 million facelift will kick off after this season and focus on the infield and premium seating. Adam Atkinson, CHH News, Toronto.